Dear, dear students, I am Ravi Kumar B, Department of Mechanical Engineering, Global Academy of Technology. Today we will have a problem on isometric projection. Okay, let us consider a problem. A square prism, a side 40 and height 50 mm. A square prism, a side 40, height 50 mm is placed centrally on a rectangular slab of side 100 and width 60 mm and thickness of the slab rectangle slab will be 20 mm. That is, height of the slab will be 20 mm. Draw the isometric projection of the combination of this solid. Here you have two combinations. One will be bottom side, you have a rectangular slab of 100 by 60 by 20 mm. Okay, above this centrally you are going to place a square prism of side 40 and 50 mm. Okay, how to solve this problem? By using ISO sketch sheet. Okay, so now for the computer, Now, go to ISO sketch sheet. I already, already told each box is measures 8.16 mm by 8.16 mm. This inclination to ISO angle that is 30 degree. Okay, all our edges will be drawn on this 30 degree line. Now, let us consider this problem. Okay, have a little bit zoom this area. Okay, first you take um, Rectangular slab, one side will be 100, other side will be 60 mm, thickness will be 20 mm. First, I'll construct base side of the rectangle. How to construct, go to visible line. Okay, I'll start from one corner of the rectangle slab. So, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and 10 boxes on one side. Okay. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. and other side you take 60. Which will be you take 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Okay, other end this will be you to take 60 100 mm this side. Now you have constructed base side of the rectangle. Base side of the rectangle you have drawn on ISO angle line. Okay, base side. Okay, one side you have taken this 30 degree line, this side you have taken. Okay, now constructed rectangular slab base side. So thickness of slab will be 20 mm. How to draw 20 mm? So vertical line should be 20. From here, take 20, two boxes. From here, you take two boxes. From here, you take two boxes. That will be use scale and pencil. Draw two boxes. Vertical line should be vertical. In isometric, all vertical edges should be vertical only. Okay, then draw, join this slab top side, we will get top side rectangular slab. Okay, all here also, this will be 100, this will be 60 with height of 20. Now, one important thing you have to hear is invisible edges when you from the front side. This will be invisible edges, not visible. Here is all the right, only retail rectangular slab and what invisible edges. Once you draw this, okay, above, now, above this you are going to place rectangular a square prism of side 40 mm. Okay, a square prism 40 mm. Rectangle of square 40. How to locate exactly center here? Before that, locate the center of this rectangle slab. How to locate the joint? Take a projection line or normal line. Okay, from midpoint of these two, midpoint of the opposite side, try a line. From again 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. From midpoint of this, to midpoint of this, okay. So you locate it center of the rectangular slab. This center and the center of the square prism should coincide, okay. The four linear. Now I'll take a slab. Now what the rectangle square slab will be 40 mm side and 50 mm high. This side to be 50 mm, 40 mm side, okay. I'll zoom a little bit. Okay, now go to line command. Draw the go to visible line. Okay, now what you say that will be from here. Okay, to side, 20, uh, total 40 mm side. This is the center point of the square prism. From here, take 20. Okay, from this side, 20. Again, from here, 20. This side, 20. All in isometric axis. Okay. 
Now from this corner, take this side 20. We have for total length to be 40. Again from here 40 on 30 degree line only. Again from here 40. And now you have constructed the upper base side of the rectangle slab. And the area is invisible. It is. This will be not required, it should be thin line. Okay, once you construct this, okay, height of the this rectangle box, uh, the square prism will be 50 mm. Take 50 mm from all four sides. 50 vertical I should be vertical. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Again from this edge, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, five boxes, 50 mm. Again from this corner, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Okay, then join this edge, join this edge. Okay, 50, sorry, this will be. On this line, this is 50. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Here, yeah, from here, join this, join this. 40 boxes, 40 square. 40. Okay, we got 40 rectangles, uh, square. Okay, then the trim this invisible inside edges, not visible. So always trim the invisible edges or detail as a thin line. Okay, once you know you have constructed both this centrally, exactly center of this square prism, you placed on the rectangle slab, top side of the rectangular slab, top side under the 40 by medium. This is how you are going to construct by using normal sketchy by using scale and pencil. And okay, now bond will be you are going to construct it to, by using um, a sketchy. Now same drawing how you are going to construct by using solid edge software. By using solid edge software How to solid edge software. Now you have to construct a first rectangular slab. Go to sketching, take line command, visible line. First, I'll construct rectangular slab. One side will be 100 mm. Enter angle 30. This angle will be 30. Other side will be 60 mm. Enter, enter angle, angle 150. Okay. Then this side will be hundred. Enter minus one fifty. Enter. Okay. Then join this. Okay. Select this line. Now make it this as normal line. Then now we are drawn base of the camera using angle for solid edge software. Now go to vertical line. To be twenty mm. Okay, make that line as um, visible line. Okay, once you draw this one, now you select this uh, rectangle slab. Okay, otherwise you can join vertical line here from here, vertical line 20. 20. You have to draw with the actual dimension. Once you draw this, now trim this version by using trim command. And is all this. Okay, so now locate this center using normal line. A midpoint to the midpoint of this opposite side. A midpoint of this side to midpoint of this side. Okay, you got the center of the Rectangular slab. Okay, in the rectangle, you have to place square prism of side 40. Okay, go to line command, go to visible line or uh, the normal line from here to here 20 mm. Okay, take non visible line only from here to here 20 on the degree line again from here to here 20.
Okay, from here to here, 20. Here, 20. Okay, join this. Now make a square flag. Twenty, forty, then forty, forty. Join. Now we got this base set of this square prism of size fourteen. Okay. Then uh, trim this portion invisible. Trim this portion. Vertical line should be vertical in square prism. So to square prism, vertical height should be 15. This side, 15 minutes. And then join all four sides. Now constructed square prism on top side and here is invisible inside edges. Then you have a prank view. There is this. Okay. Okay. Now you have constructed a square slab of side. 16 length uh, width will be 60 and uh, length under mm height the thickness of the slab will be 20 above this you are placed centrally on a square prism of 40 inside and height 15 and this also not visible to this portion okay this is how you are going to construct by using solid edge software okay and uh, in this uh, session i had uh, explained both uh, manual drawing as well as how to construct by using software solid edge st9 thank you